happy Monday, favorite day of the week. <laughs> it's 3.30 p.m. We are getting ready to head out for the day and run some errands outside. We've been working inside all day. And now we're getting ready to go outside. And this guy decided she wants to do my edges today. Set. So we're going to see. Oh, 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 oh. We're going to see if she can do them better than me. I don't know. Get out of here. I'm the original. <laughs> I'm the original. Okay, 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 <laughs> she made us soup like a couple weeks ago and she keeps talking about this damn pot so we're gonna return that and probably steal some more dishes because she cooked us lunch again she's a heavy sleeper good morning Miko how are you hi you're so sleepy all the time how come you're here in the dark Jen how are you mom Oh, I forget there was light. <laughs> Everybody wants to know how you're feeling. Oh, Lord of mercy. I'm good, girl. <laughs> with my rum and coke. Okay. <laughs> Let me find out. I'm okay. Your cough? I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm really okay. How's your cough? It's gone? The cough is coming along, good. That's good. The wheezing is going. I'm doing good. Yeah. Good. I'm loving you, girls. Oh. Kiss the good life. Good, good, good. Kiss the good life. You hear Marley chasing half around the house. We stopped and got her some food. This is her <laughs> this is her favorite food by Benefold the Incredibites for small dogs. She loves this stuff. And I got her some treats. She loves marrow bones, but normally I get her the beef flavor. And I noticed they have a new flavor, bacon and cheese. So we're gonna see if she likes it. You wanna try it? It's bacon and cheese. Tell, tell them if you like it. You wanna do a taste test? Tell the people what you think. How's it? Oh, you like it. You like it? She's chomping at it. How is it? Does it taste like bacon? Mmm, no. Let the people know. Do a review. <laughs> Let me find out you're about to get uh, sponsored by, yes. what was that, Purina? Hey, Yum. You love it? That only took 2.5 seconds. This is our dinner from Mama Daily. We're going to eat it later. You guys, you guess what she made. Oh, I showed them. I showed them. She made all the stuff. No, it's If not you me. know me. We're going to have to just eat that. If you know me. You will know, oxtail is the way to my heart. Oxtail. Hey guys, happy Wednesday is hump day. I just did um, brows and gloss today. And mascara and edges. My point is I don't have foundation and contour and highlight and all that extra on. Got some orders done, I'm about to go ship those off and I got a lot of like administrative, I guess you could say stuff done with the house called water gas electricity um internet all of the utilities to advise them of my last day of service which is coming up so shortly y'all so shortly i'm really excited about it and i'm super happy too because you know i saw a meme posted by a very smart woman on instagram that said people who abandon you don't love you they were just using you 
And the more I think about it, the more that is absolutely true. Abandonment is not an act of love at all. And I'm tired of being used. And the thing about it is he's still using me if you think about it because you guys have heard me say multiple times that I am over this. I don't want to stay here and break my back doing all this yard work and housework and maintenance, paying all these expensive ass bills. Like I've said it multiple times that I want to be on a beach with some new dick too. There's so many times I've wanted to call it quit and just let the bank come and repo this shit, but I didn't. And that's why he left because he knew I wouldn't leave. He's using me because I'm the responsible one and he knew I would stay and break my back to protect our investment. And I'm over it. I'm over being a donkey for that bitch, you know what I mean? I'm over breaking my back, I'm over the stress, I'm over all that, like I just need to get out of here. I've been saying it for so long, I need to get out of here. I, if I'm gonna break my back for anybody, it's gonna be me. Okay, so the countdown is on y'all, the countdown is on, we're about to be out of here ASAP. So, getting shit done. I've asked this courier a million times to get a doorstop. How are you a shipping company, but don't have a doorstop? <sighs> like the little things, that would be such a small, small improvement. What would that cost you? $10? Just to put one of those little, you know, kickstands on your door? Good morning guys today is saturday i'm so tired I'm making some tea i went to bed pretty late last night but i'm up bright and early because i'm having an indoor garage sale today guys let me show you my little setup okay i put everything in the dining room that's going so we've got TV stands, cabinets, some houseware products, chairs, some clothes, some shoes, some furniture, some artwork, my Wii system. I've got some games back here. Just trying to downsize a little bit, as you guys know. So I put it up on... Um, on Kijiji as well as uh, Facebook Marketplace from 10 to 5 so we'll see how many people come through. It's pretty late, it's 8 p.m. My indoor garage sale did pretty well you guys. I have a ton of stuff left still but I got rid of quite a bit as well. I have a TV stand that was over there and I got rid of some statues and I got rid of some kitchenware and um, yeah made a couple hundred bucks so now I'm gonna go spend it. And treat myself to dinner none of my clothes went i'm gonna actually take more stuff out of my closet and then do a plato's what's that place called plato's closet run um because a lot of this stuff is like brand new with tags still you know it's eight yeah it's 8 15. i don't really think we have anything to cook the fridge is kind of empty so we might as well go out treat ourselves to dinner